Well guys, we just made it here to Kansas and I had a little dilemma. Um, my Alpine Star shoes accidentally got left at the shop, so the guys from Alpine Star hooked me up. Oh, they're the white ones. My favorite. But we are getting right into it. We got practice coming up here really quick. Actually, the pitch just opened in 30 minutes until practice, so I'm gonna go get my suit on, go out, make some laps, qualify, and then wait till tonight to race. Stop it. Stop, babe, come here. He's wearing the underwear. <laughs> All of a sudden I hear him say, look how weird this is. Zach's wearing your underwear. I go. I <laughs> see. Good quality. <laughs> Just brought some little kids over yep. here for you to. What are you talking about? So guys, you guys having fun yet? Yeah. Sweating yet? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you excited to watch the race today? Yeah, I'm surprised you're not sweating. I am sweating. <laughs> you just can't see it. I got my suit on. <laughs> you're not sweating? Oh, you're tough. My earbuds in here? My head's off? Oh, yeah, you should be on the home of Earth. Uh, oh, perfect. I can't believe you Thanks. wear them green foamies. The other ones feel like I am a ride or die by foamies. I go and I spend 300 bucks on molds every single year. Yeah. Hate them, always go back to foamies. No, like whatever we changed there, it needed the complete opposite. Good. Like okay. exactly the opposite, and it would have been great. Okay. But no, that was bad. It really. Okay. I was pulled. I first thought we had a left front going now. So I thought, okay. So I made a turn better, but the left front's just not working. That's fine. It made the left front completely not work. Okay. So if we go back to the first run, it's just a little lazy getting in the corner. A little lazy getting in the corner. Ain't bad. Not you bad. Can deal with that. That's better than being too loose getting in, right? Mm -hmm. In the back would just barely try to step out. In the back, I would just get down, get down, and just like occasionally lay in the corner because I felt like I had more wheel than I should have on entry. It wasn't free at all in entry, but I had more wheel than I should have. And then like that two-thirds mark of the corner, it would kind of just start kicking in the rear, which I was... Would it hold itself or was it... It was like, it was at the point where if someone was in front of me... We need, you need some help. I would have been out of the gas a little bit. Mike, 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 where's Mike? Dude, I lose him all the time. I can never find him. You gotta look for the cigarette smoke. <laughs> oh, he's taping out the nose. <laughs> I had a good pit road exit. <laughs> you did great. You did great. You did great. You did great. I'm proud of you. A John Forster, like Don't you told sweat. me. <laughs> well, we just got back from grabbing some food. Qualifying went decent, I would say. We aren't as trimmed out as a lot of the other guys in front of us are, but some of our buddies from YouTube hit us up. Junkyard Digs are out here hanging out at the race, just watching it all, taking it all in. So we're going to go over there and go talk to them. You know why this thing barely made it? It's because it's a Chevy. <laughs> we brought a Ford last year. Not gonna lie, it was a little better. We have a 1988, uh, the box truck. It overheats if you get it over like 60. <laughs> yeah, we were like, oh, we, our speedometer doesn't work, but I could use the thermostat to kind of see where really? we were going. It's like, <laughs> oh, there's 210. We should probably slow her down a little. I <laughs> get the Snapchat filter out and check you. you. You really live the junkyard vibes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is the good one. The other one didn't make it, so we're like, that's probably gonna kill us. Let's take the good one, the $500 one instead of the free one. Wow, 500 We overpaid for ours. <laughs> they seem like a really good group of guys, but I gotta head back right now. We are on the clock. I gotta go get my suit on and head out the race. For you? Look at this. Thank you so much. Give a marker. Oh, you just made our whole weekend. Aww. Seriously. Oh. No, I thank you guys for coming out. I really appreciate yeah, it. <laughs> There's that one. There's that one. Yeah. From California, Haley Deegan. Dude, they 
gave me a head sock and it's like 17 layers. And it's way too thick. They usually have the NASCAR ones are the one layer ones. I have a knife sponsorship. Well, just because I own a helmet doesn't make me an astronaut. <laughs> <laughs> Almost, almost. Can we pull part up? Oh. Go. No, pull that. Side by himself, door. Bumper still gonna be there. He group, get another run and go after him again. You're clear by five. Chasing, good job. He's going to get him. All right, he's gonna slide. Job to give him a little bit of room. Here he comes. Give room. Outside. Perfect. Good job. Your rhythm. Watch him. Follow him. Work on it. So that's exactly what you gotta do. Tell us about your truck. I feel like we're just starting to lose the nose. I feel like just wearing the nose more than the rear. Uh, and we're just getting tight. Uh, I feel like tightness starts all the way in trees to exit. Not terrible, I'd say probably a two out of ten. Five, four, three, two, one. Right here. Good. <laughs> Wait, don't go until I tell you. Ready? Green, 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 roll, good, roll, good. Right to the right side, you're good. I don't care what they do in front of you, you're gonna run the top. Still clear behind him here. Not worried about it, he's the only one kind of catching you a little bit here. You're good. Make a burn in here, you're fine. Just hit your marks up there. You're still plenty good. In three, kind of running a lane lower than you. Just keep hitting your marks. You'll be fine. You should tighten up a little bit. They're definitely a little better. Entry protecting the right side here. You can be hold my breath on that entry a little bit. Good work. I back, lifted early, went to the top. No threat. I didn't hate that bottom through three and four, Haley. I don't think it was terrible. Be back. No threat. We'll get the other cautions out. Caution is out. Loose both in. Yeah, I just feel like I'm out of the track. All right, we'll get you tight back up some here. Five, four, three, two, one. In the middle, stay in the middle here. You're in the middle. You're in the middle. In the middle. Upper clear. All clear. No threat. You're about to push the pass there. Good drive. Keep digging. Let's go. Better than the next four or five. Just follow up through there. Do your deal. Two back, you're all good. Keep it wound up until you can pounce. Outside only, you can drive off of him, clear right up behind him if he gets you. Caution's out, caution's out. I had one hit the wall in turn one. I think this is the best I have, balance-wise, for being able to run by myself and then run with people. Five, four, three, two, one. That's gonna be about 20th, Haley. Yep, I can tell. You got 39 to go. Everybody's as pissed off and aggravated as you are, but take a deep breath, relax for a minute, go get them, okay? 508 creep, ready, don't go. Go, 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 go. Super loose, that is one. Yeah, we're just really loose. So stupid, Creed. 10 I can see it, try not to make it any worse. Just do what you can here, nice and smart. I don't understand it either, we made no changes, no stagger, no nothing. Tires even look the same. And our truck just go to shit. No idea. Trying to stay in a lucky dog spot here, so just keep hitting your mark. I don't, I don't know what happened, but immediately entering turn one, it was just looser than it's ever been. Yeah, we can see it, and we don't know either. Exit. Yep. There you go. No pressure. All clear. All clear. I believe that's another spot. Good job. All right, girl. 17th. I can't understand it. Bad set of tires or something. We'll keep working on it. We'll go get him in Texas. For Kaylee, that's a really good race you drove there. Learned a lot. You did really good. I really don't. Like, I changed absolutely nothing on this. And it was like you flipped a switch. Ran, you did everything you were supposed to. You moved top, bottom, middle. You protected your right side when you needed to. You made aggressive moves when you need to. And that would have been 12. And then the 51 hit the fence. And somebody else had an issue. 42 had an uncontrolled tire. The cars you raced around all night ended up 10th. I feel like to fire off, it wasn't bad. We were running in the top 15, um, doing actually pretty good, kind of just picking off one at a time, and it's tough to pass here. Running around the 88 and 23 all day, which are fast trucks. We came down to pit for the final stage and the last stop, 
And we ended up coming down 14th, leaving 21st, 22nd. So that honestly ruined our race and I'm super, super bummed about it. Uh, but when we uh, changed that set of tires and we instantly dropped like a fly, like truck balance was super loose. End of the day, I feel like I did my part this race. I had some of the best, uh, best kind of races, in my opinion, driving wise ever. So, I mean, I was, I was putting some pretty good moves on the 52, pulling off the 88, um, even the 23s went championship, like, like we were just doing good. And so, is what it is. So, be sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. We appreciate all the support. See you next time. Give me all of your lies, cause you're my